Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. So today we are headed back to JC Automotion. This is probably the last time you guys see the truck until I unveil it. So I am super excited because today I think everything is wrapped on the truck. Now obviously the grill, all that stuff is getting painted all the little chrome trim pieces but the mirrors in the side trim piece where the windows are those are all getting wrapped so i should be there in like about a minute or so we're gonna walk inside and see where they are i am like super nervous about this because i don't normally do things like this but i really thought that buying this dually was a good purchase for the channel because i i don't really give you guys a lot of content on dually so owning one has made it easier to like obviously give you guys the content told with them and kind of give you my impressions living with them day to day now granted chevy's not the best example because they have a really good riding truck so let's go ahead and go inside and see what's going on and yeah we'll see uh where they are with the project we're back again all right let's go see oh so the tires are gone that's a good thing right there actually so the tires are gone and let's go ahead and check out and see what they've done with the dually What's up, bro? How's it going? How's the camera, man? How's it going, guys? What's up? What's up? Hey, guys. Oh, yo. Okay, so it looks like they're in process of wrapping the mirrors. They look really, oh, wow. They did a gloss black. That's going to look so good. What? Yo, guys, check this out. They went with a gloss at first. And it looks like they switched over to like a satin. To match the plastic yo that looks so good <laughs> yes i am so glad i went with jc on motion guys man it looks so good let's check out the inside oh yeah the sad looks so much better than the gloss did oh my goodness so they're still wrapping the mirrors now we're still doing a gloss here because the wheels are going to be gloss and something else is going to be gloss too i think yeah i think that's it actually Man, it looks so good. Now let's see if we can find these wheels. Hey Jordan. Yo. Yo. Good eye on that satin. How's it going? What's up? Good eye on the satin, on the window. We wouldn't let you go with gloss, don't worry. We no, got no, you covered. That was fire. I, you know, when they were doing it in gloss, I was like, but you know what? The satin was fire. Yeah, we, we got you. We no, got that you covered. so good. Thank you. You wrapping them up right now? Yes, yep. We're nice. doing some clear bra and Tinting and you know we're always busy so always busy keeping it pushing. It's all right. It's all yeah, right. it's well, good. I'll always good. Back to it then. Yes, thank you, Justin. Have a great day. All right, let's go find Jesus, the owner. Hey, you What's busy? Up? You I'm busy? Always busy. What's going on? Hey, uh, you told me the wheels were here, right? Are they here? Uh, they're here, but it's not ready yet. They're here. They're not here yet. Are you gonna let me see them? I gotta show the, I gotta show the channel, man. You can't, you can't see them yet. What? You gotta wait till they're done, man. <laughs> no yeah. surprises hey. for you. Hey, you see that guy? See, they won't even let me see the truck. So, are the wheels, are the wheels done? They, they're done. They're done? But they're not ready. They're not ready? Are you guys, so are you guys mounting the tires? Is that what you guys are doing right now? Uh, yeah. Okay, so he look. So, Jesus, guys, this is the owner. <laughs> he won't even let me see my own truck, guys. You see that? You gotta wait. That's okay, though. That's you okay. Be surprised. I respect that. I respect yeah, you that, be surprised. bro. <laughs> you guys know I'm gonna show you the wheels, right? Obviously, Jesus was actually just joking around there, but um, he told me where the tires and wheels were. They're getting mounted as we speak, so I don't know where they are in the process. I don't know what to expect when I get there. All I can tell you is it's just dropped off. So, we're gonna head down the street. And we're gonna see if we can see some 18 inch wheels blacked out. They're gonna be painted with 37s potentially. Potentially. They're definitely painted. We're two minutes away and I'm a little nervous, man. Like, I don't know why I'm so nervous. Like, it is what it is. I knew I was gonna be doing this, but like for some weird reason, I have like a little bit of butterflies. Not because of what it's gonna look like, I think I'm a little nervous by these 37s. Like, oh, I don't know why I went this big on tires. Whew. So we'll see how it looks. And I do know that they can cut the wheel wells for me, JC Automotion. They say they can do it for me if, if it rubs too bad. So we'll see how it all shakes out. But like I said, I think I see big old right here. You ready? You're about to see these tires and wheels, guys. If, well, you were going to see the wheels at the very least, and you might see the tires mounted, potentially. 
big old tires. Man, this is a really tight. Oof, I gotta go around. Wow. That's the only thing bad about the city. There's just never any place to park. Ever. All right, guys, so we're at Big Old Tires. Oh, yes. Yes, they look What's so going on, man? good. What's that? What's it going on? On oh, no, a dually, it's a Chevy Silverado. Yeah, looks so good. Looks so much better. I just made it back home and yo, I shouldn't have went by there. I should not have gone by and looked at those wheels. I am so excited now, I can't wait. I'm not gonna be able to sleep for like the next three days because I want the truck back today. Like, <laughs> oh man, it's gonna look so stinking good. Like you guys don't understand, I am so excited. I should listen to Jesus, he told me, don't go by there. He said, just wait till it's done, bro. You're gonna get excited. And he was right, because the bumpers are not painted yet, so we don't know when that's gonna get done. And we gotta let the paint cure, and then we gotta put PPF on it. Ah, oh, I should've waited, should've waited. But it's okay, it's okay. You know, I don't know about you guys, but I know sometimes, and I'm, I'm not, I hope I don't offend anybody, but sometimes people get in their feelings. And, you know, I hope that this doesn't come off as me bragging or anything like that, because I don't wanna do that. I hope that these things encourage you. You know, I lost my job last year. You guys know this, I've said it a hundred times probably, because I just want you guys to be reminded that where I was last year, I haven't really said this out loud, you know, because I obviously have a family and I wanna make sure they know that they're always secure and okay, but like I was in a bad spot, like because I feel like I failed. And where I'm at right now, this was never even a dream. Like I know that I've been able to, you know, own some cool cars, things like that. But for the most part, I was living within my own, you know, in my own strength, as I call it. And I'm telling you guys, it's not me. When you guys ask me, how are you able to afford all these trucks? It's not me, I'm telling you, like, I don't have to tell you that it's God because you know where I stand with that. I am 100% believer of Jesus, that's it. I'm telling you guys, it's not me. Because like, even the fact that I found Jerry Signer Chevy and how accommodating they've been. And even though like they got me in touch with JC Automotion and like they've been really easy to work with, like they've been really helping me with this build because this build is not cheap, but it's not super expensive. If I was going anywhere else, I'd probably be paying probably another thousand or so more just because it is what it is. But my point is JC Automotion, Jerry Signer, like all this stuff that has happened up until this point, like it's not me. I'm serious, like this dually, was never supposed to be purchased. Like This was not even a part of my plan. This dually just came up out of nowhere. I just wanted to do a review on it, and I made a joke to Keith at Jerry Signer about, hey, I'll buy it if you sell it to me below invoice. As a joke, and he did it. He was like, you know what, sure. Because you've been helping us with sales, things like that, I'll do it for you. And now we're building this truck. It's gonna be absolutely amazing. Like seriously, guys, like you don't understand. Like I am, I am on cloud nine right now. Like I. <laughs> I should not have gone by and look at those wheels, but I hope that this video inspires you. That, that's, that's the only point I wanna say is don't think that this is me bragging because I'm serious when I say this, like, I don't deserve this. Like, I don't deserve this kind of happiness because of what I've gone through. Like, I feel like I should be struggling right now, but I've stayed faithful. And I'm telling you, if there's anything that you get from this video and any video that I do is stay faithful. Do not give up. Do not allow things in your head to dictate where you go if it's not positive. Like always think positive, think of yourself less. I'm serious when I say this, like where I'm at right now is not me. Like I can't take responsibility for none of this, none of it. So I, again, I'm done rambling, but I really feel like I needed to say that. And yeah, I'm just, yeah. Now it's just time to make money. <laughs> that, that's where we are now. So. This will be a rental. So if you live in Utah, guess what? You get to enjoy this truck. Like this truck will be yours to have for as long as you want it. It will be expensive, I'm not gonna lie to you, but if you have a birthday coming up, if you just wanna try out a dually, if you've never had one before, this is the only time you'll ever have a chance to drive a dually with 37s the way this is. And this truck, I'm serious when I say this, 
it is going to be a head turner. It is going to be so cool. And you will have the opportunity to drive this truck. So definitely do it sooner than later because it could be a rental for a week or it could be a rental for six months. I don't even know how long I'll have it on there. I'm just knowing in my head that if I love this truck a lot, I may not have it long. I might sell the white truck in this truck and then order me another truck and basically build that one to this spec. So yeah, stay tuned. Got some great things coming. I know you guys are excited. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Like you subscribing is like a big thing because this is why I do this now. I do this for a living and I'm telling you, supporting this channel means you're supporting even bigger projects in the future. I don't say this out loud a lot. I'm crazy. Like I will do stupid things because I like to have fun. Like I shouldn't even be saying this because I, I'm going to make a video about it and I'm kind of getting way too ahead of myself. I'm going to say it. I don't care. I want to come in this white truck. That's what I want to do next. Like that is like, I'm going to put that on a board right now. I don't even know how I'm going to do that because I legit don't have the money to. I want to put a Cummins in that truck. That is the plan. Now, not to say I don't like the white truck and the 6.6 .6 gas. It's just, it already has a 10 speed Allison and I want to be the first one to do it. This truck is perfect. All it needs is a diesel. And I don't know how I'm going to do it. Like, I don't know if I can even make that happen. I don't know if it's even possible, but I'm going to say it here because I don't know how it's going to happen. And a lot of things in my life, I didn't know how they happen and they happen. And guess what? I'm going to put this on, on record now. I'm going to put this on record. Cummins in the white truck. Peace out.